talaga because uh, mentally, physically, these players are really battered. Hook hook talaga sila lalo na ito sa top series for a great crossover move. Terrence Romeo. Terrence Bray Romeo. Ang lagro ng iyong kata but look at this nice nifty move. Look at that crossover. Crossover skills. Sino ba ni Santos? Pajolins wala. Junmar. Air ball on the follow up. Romeo receives it mula kay Pinto. Romeo trying to get away from Love. And Terrence has gone back to back. Sa eksena si Aaron Santos. Then it was Chris Lutz who was trying to stop Rome. Nagantay muna ng rest back dito. Teka, teka, teka. Si Karakter ang tapong naiwan. Ayun yung kanyang mga rebounder. Ang maganda lang daw doon, malayo din yung depensa ng dalawa. So Romeo takes advantage. We're left in the backcourt. Look up the, you know, underneath. Walang kato. What's your story? Other big guy there. Jumar was on top because yung tao nga niya. Inano pa sa back. He's tall. He's strong. Ang kagandahan sa kanya, pwede siyang dimipensa na mas maliit, na mas mabilis. O kahit ang mas malaki, then yung pride niya while playing defense. Look at that! Oh! 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 Terrence Romeo scoring against... Patlong nilampasan. He sidesteps to avoid Jairis. And then he hangs in the air long enough to take a selfie. And hits it off the glass. They're coming out flat to open this contest. Ang Blackwater po is on a roll. Abante na ng patlong puntos. Romeo working against Celis. Kinamita ng crossover. The Terrence special is good. RG ano isang gabi every time magkakakita ka ng airball at this level oh, pero yan hindi airball yan <laughs> napakagandang kilos yan ito yun. yung talagang you really gear up for pati yung training schedule nyo dito nyo ibinubo sa mga ganitong matcha basically before the season nagkahanap ka na hindi ako kaya I have 11 games sino ba kaya kong talunin para ito na magiging ka Herwela Tautin and Gamalinda binabatayan si na Romeo Then it's easy, Warner and Ringo, there it's Romeo, gets that pass, it makes a sum of a card. One-on-one hit right. Grabe, yung bilis ng tennis Romeo with that dribble. And this cool move is brought to us by Preston Kulan. Preston Kulan is always cool under pressure, protects against overheating and is... You get up in the air, you know, you're gonna see somebody meet you up in the air, you have a lot of problems. Romeo contra Barroca. Two former Tamaraos going at it. Terrence Romeo gets that bucket. Patungo pa siya sa free throw line. Medyo nagmamature na rin sa ano. Medyo sa kumiya sa TV display. When he was in the army, he had to play honest defense. Romeo Digiscarte contra Dito de Magliari. Seven seconds remaining sa ating first half. Romeo, nice fake and school. Romeo delivers the two points. Ringel contra Barroca. And off pagunta kay Romeo. Romeo and Barroca going at it. Romeo with a getaway. There's no pressure at all on the guy who is even inbounding in the one who's shooting. Look at the pocket passes by Drew Boots. This time it's broken up. Romeo, open court situation. Tatlo kalaban. Alam problema. Full court press muli ang global fourth. Oh, Romeo gets the steal. Terence to the basket, Bini hit pa, Terence Romeo gets two. I feel because of how Alaska played, they have inspired a lot of teams to play Ulo. Nagkabanggaan sila netong si Anthony Semerad, but the two points will count para sa carnival. Romeo and Leslie, two-man game. Terence, step back, jumper up, jumper down for Romeo. <laughs> Malaking tao po oh, si Kelly Navo, ha? 6'5 yan! Here's Romeo on the dribble. Romeo against the import. No problem for Terrence. Nine seconds on the shot clock. Terrence yo-yoing with E. Romeo going right. Jumper up. Jumper good. Oh, Terrence Romeo with a nice. Anthony contra Tony. Back over to Terrence. Baguio trying to keep in step with a young gun from FBU. Step back, jumper, Romeo specialist. Romeo once again looking at Labo. Gets it to Semerad. Door shut on him by Tony. Romeo, left corner pocket, one dribble, pull up. Romeo starting to make some noise. Yeah, gun zero and two, no? Global court naman, as Miss Erica mentioned earlier on. Replay Meralco, no? Sunday. Sunday, Boa Arena, Meralco magkakatapan. Noel Gilingen also there. There's Romeo right off the bat. 
Galaxy Dynamite Danny Siegel coming from his hamstring injury. However, Ryan Reyes and Kelly Williams still won't be seeing action today. At wala pa silang maibigay na date kung kailan sila makababalik. Sa Global Fork naman, iparito. And it's Robio for three. Off the glass. Plus the foul. Alam niya eh kung saan pupuntay na dulas. Itong si Alas and then Jason Castro just trying to help out. Knowing that he's got the shot up already. Nani siyang natutulog ng maaga at 11 p.m. gabi-gabi. I'm ashamed of myself. Bakit? Ang mabogchi pa ako. Tumatapos si Lofit is mga kamote ka. Hindi na mahirap na kamote. Kaya nangyari sa akin. Hindi nangyari sa akin. There is Romeo. Five. And he hits another three. And fit. He wasn't fit rather. But he's fitter. And he's quicker. Para dito kay Terrence Romeo. And it's reaping benefits for his ball game. Ang magkalaban. That would be fantastic. Kasama ko pa yung Bruce Brothers. Oo. All in one game. Shot clock down to eight. Terrence Romeo for three. Yes, sir. There's Ruby. Has been very shot clock down to 11. Time winding down dito sa opening period. Terrence against Uyloan. Romeo. Wow. That is a... By Rainer Shine. But Global Port naman, they have been sucked into what Rainer Shine wants them to do, which is play one more last one. Terrence Romeo. They have a nice two-man game going here. That's important, Tiana. You know, you always talk about, you know, if you're a coach, you want to be able to put your players in a position to be able to maximize their strength. And if you're a point guard, there is Romeo with 20 points. One-on-one against Paul Lee. Terrence fires a three. Yes, sir! Three points. He's forcing him to go left, but Romeo Went left, pero medyo to the side and away. And now, it's back to an 8-point lead para sa Panthers. With under a minute left in the fourth quarter. Terrence Romeo for three. Yes, sir! He's not done. Paul Lee and Terrence Romeo. Here's Terrence. Terrence for three. Yes, sir! 29 points. Three quarters. Edok. Keith Jensen. Now in the game, and here's Terence Romeo. That's a three points. And uh, they can set him up with Terence Romeo and Stanley Pringle and even a Den of Miranda. They're going to be very difficult to stop. Well, right now, Terence uh, Romeo. Vito, Ponferrada, character, Romeo, and Semarat. Terence for three. Yes, sir. Not necessarily. Look at that. Look at how quick he is. And the elevation, the quickness to get up. Hindi nakakahabol yung bench shots. You know, in the first two quarters, they were able to get yung mga shots that were given to them. But in the third and the fourth quarter, they actually dictated the shots that they could get. There's something that's very different. Rich Alvarez, he, he's not a young player, but he's still one of you know, the best defenders when it comes to someone guarding someone his size. Very, very agile, very mobile as... Romeo can highlight to YouTube. Mm. They're just not that kind of player. And they're not that kind of uh, that kind of uh, athlete. And then when you play, uh, Terence Romeo connects. This is a commissioner's cup action. At una po hold para sa Barako hindi pumasok. Ayon, Terence Romeo, the scoring guard para sa Global Court, hits his first shot. Well, he was then foul called against uh, Barako. Barako Bull. Barako Energy. Romeo dribbling display ang ginawa tapos sinking the three-pointer brought to us by PLDD Hotel by this point. And sabi mo, yung backboard eh, ganda ng ginagawa. Romeo, hindi naman naman yun, no? iniwan ang defender. Step back. Terrence Romeo with the ball right now. Paolo Valde trying to defend. Ito si Romeo on the move once again. Kinaliwa kahit nandun si Alabi. So anyway, Romeo steps back. Terrence Romeo! 
Very he's hard. actually Denok Miranda. And interestingly enough, di ba second conference pala niya nandito, technically, pang ilang laro pa lang ngayon eh. Kasi, nung nalipat siya, you know, last conference was very late. Di ba? Very late. One game lang. Denok getting instructions from Coach Eric Gonzalez. Romeo against Apunya. Puts up a long one. Ah! Romeo in trouble. Ross all over him. Sticky defense. Kinagamit dito ni Chris Ross. Down about a seven second differential to beat the corner clock. And shot clock. Romeo creates a win. That did you make some pain? That's a good defense by the initial guy. Ponferrada gets it to Romeo. Stop and pop. 16 footer. Terrence drills it. After a certain point, you have to be aggressive. Before you try to use the clock to your advantage, you have to make sure the, the lead is that safe. Romeo from the outside, drills in three. It's other than because he's going up for a basket, you're able to float. Nakakita pa ng cutter na Michael Janigan itong si Joseph. Yes, Romeo.